station here. Looks good. Great growth is good, but I like this as well. It's much easier, slower pace, more relaxing. Good to be back. But we have a lot of work to do here, though. Alrighty, we are back. I just love this view. It's so nice out here and quiet. I wonder if there's any deers. No, I don't see any deers right now, but I know they're there. Oh yeah, I hope they keep this place like this. We don't need any more houses or anything. It's, it's, it's perfect. It's beautiful Molokai. But I still live here. It's kind of windy out today. You know, these coconut trees. We're over at the coconut grove. There's Vanessa. Hello. So we got this. Oh, here. Can you hold it? Alright, so we got, finally got this uh, flagpole base. Yes, sorry, sorry. There you go. Okay. So we finally got the flagpole came in. So this is the base here, so I gotta put some sand in the bottom. Yeah. For weight. Closest beach is here uh, by Kapuvai. And see the coconut grove here. Come in and go by the soft part. Don't be here hard you already. Huh? So sorry. I am talking like that. Pigeon, sorry. Yeah. Where's the oh, where's the pole? The black I got it in my hand. Okay. I'm sorry. You're gonna edit this, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Turn it down more so it goes towards your thumb. Yeah. Right, back at the church. It's a beautiful uh, plumeria. So nice. So, this is the base. And we are going to Bring the flagpole in. Yep. Alright, so we've always had the American flag in this church, but not a Hawaiian flag. So, we're finally putting in a Hawaiian flag after. About a year, it took about a year. So our elder was able to secure a Hawaiian flag and I got the flag pole, so we are going to install it. It's got the American flag and the Hawaiian flag. Oh, there it is. Hawaiian flag. Hawaii punoi nanai komoi kala after that uh, K -L -E -E. No. what was after that I forget anyhow I tried <laughs> I need to read the lyrics somewhere yeah. it's a nice church it's always nice here just waiting for our flower delivery for the middle Hmm? The height. the height? Yeah, looks about the same. Okay. 
was the other verse? Uh, oh, I remember this other verse. The um, Makualaniye Kamehamehae Na Kaua E Pale E Kaihe I think. Laniye Kamehamehae Na <laughs> there you go I think good try but anyhow yeah we got our Hawaiian flag after a year of being here so praise the Lord for that it's not matching oh it's okay alright all right, so we move the flag in here. So sort of look like this instead. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, so it looks nice like this too. So we'll see what how everyone else feels about this. Alright. God created this Three. planet for man and yet he Three. wanted to destroy what he created because of the evilness and the vile that was going on during that time. Now think about it, during that time. They were doing the exact same things as we're doing today in our time. The vileness, the, um, the abundance of everything, the abundance of eating, the abundance of drinking, the abundance of everything during their time. It's just like us, the abundance. We have a lot of them. We eat, okay? My Hawaiian culture, we grind, okay? We grind. Yes, we grind. And that, to me, has a lot to do with a lot of our diseases, diabetes and whatnot, but the abundance of the food, they overindulged in everything. But the one thing they didn't indulge in was God. Mm. They indulged in wickedness. Mm. So, and the, end, this, in the, the section is titled, The Seventh Trumpet, and, and you know, we know that's the last trumpet, that's the last, last sounding trumpet, right. and it says that the seventh angel blew his trumpet, and there were loud voices, this is Revelation 11, Verse 15 through 19. Seventh angel blew his trumpet and there were loud voices in heaven. Well, that's kind of how I imagine the things that would happen. So when you talk about the flood and the whole earth got covered, we, we got to put ourselves in that person's position that we're talking to because they might have a totally different view of what's happening. Okay. It's simply an alliance, an agreement, a promise, or a pledge. And in this case, the covenant, the promise that God was making to Noah was to save his family. As opposed to what we read in Genesis chapter 6. Seventh-day Adventist Church, so glad to see all of you here this morning. I gotta tell you, when we, when us and I arrived here, I know I said, if any man is thirsty, let him come to me and drink. He who believes in me, as the scripture said, from his innermost being shall flow rivers of living water. Our God who took on flesh, our Jesus, the provider of the everlasting water in pain and in agony uttered those two words, I thirst. 
written. He went to Scripture and he followed Scripture. When Satan comes to you, run to Jesus and start praying. Start reading your Bible promises. It is written in Psalm 55, 22. Cast your cares on the Lord and he will sustain you. He will never let the righteous fall. Amen? It is written, Joshua 1, 5. I will never leave you nor forsake you. It is written, Jeremiah 29, 11, For I know the thoughts that I think toward you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you a future, to give you a hope. Then he will call upon me and go and pray to me, and I will listen to you, and you will seek me and find me when you search for me with all your heart. Alright, so uh, church service is done, and... We are now at the beach for baptism, so we're gathering around. Oh, it's really windy today. So, there's Vanessa. Oh, it's nice out though. So, I'll be baptizing uh, Maybelline over here. Oh, there's Ted. Hello, Ted. So, uh, this is Ted right here. Hello. Aloha. Aloha. I might have touched that. Yeah, yeah. Don't touch that yeah. red one. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Make it just So if it blinks out, look in the front. It should be a. Um, How do I make it go if something does happen? So it'll be blinking. Like okay. This. But if it goes off, then just hit this again and then you'll just scream. Okay. 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 Ok
Hello, hello. Alright, so, and there's Colleen here. Hello, hello. Alright, and that's Captain Dan. Okay, we just got the red scarf. So, it's so you don't hit your head. Somebody yeah, put that yeah, I would take it out. Oh, that's yours. Okay. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Well, so the Lord held back the rain for us, which was good. So, we got to have a nice lunch. And now, we are leaving. So, what a awesome day today. Thank you, Jesus. And yeah, we're taking Captain Dan home with us. All right, signing off. All right, so we are at the Molokai Airport, heading back to Oahu. So today was a good day. Good day. Yeah. Black day. Baptism and everything, and good fellowship lunch, and yeah. So now we're gonna head back to Oahu because we have a big meeting tomorrow constituency meeting for our church so it's going to be a big event uh, church-wide on Hon um, Oahu, Honolulu so we're going to be attending that. Alright so I hope you enjoyed the video of uh, Molokai and our church and uh, if you like the video go ahead and hit the like button and uh, if you haven't subscribed yet uh, please hit the subscribe button so that you will get a uh, notification of our uh, new updates uh, videos. Alright uh, I guess until then, uh, aloha and uh, mahui ho. And remember that God loves you and, and so, so do we. we.